from Minnesota's most watched station. This is WCCO 4 News, live at the Minnesota State Fair. Hi, I'm Willa. And I'm Maya. This is your WCCO at the State Fair newscast. We begin today with a developing story from the Midway. Right now, State Fair officials are on the lookout for a giant stuffed gorilla. Where turtles, it's black and white and lime green, and it's at least eight feet tall. It was last spotted near the Ferris wheel. Officials don't think he's dangerous, but if you see, see him, call 911. Over near the pet center, fairgoers are reporting a strange howling s sound. Officials were called in to investigate. It turns out it was just the dogs at the pet center trying to keep up with all the people belting out. Usher and Sam Hunt songs at the giant scene along. That's a look at your state fair headlines. Let's send it over to sports. Hi, I'm Owen. With uh, a look at sports, a bit of co controversy is brewing after a grand, a new grand champion was named after the state fair, Ring Toss Rodeo. A 10-year-old girl went from the her iron range, went from 5 to 5, beating Chris Schaffer. Well, by one of WCCO's investigate team is on the story. It looks like the 10-year-old girl was a ringer brought in from I Iowa. Well, continue to... Thank you. It is a hot one out here at the Minnesota State Fair, so hot that ice cream cones are melting in less than two minutes. Snow cones are lasting only about three minutes and a warning that brain freeze numbers have tripled this year as fairgoers try to keep cool. Good day, I'm Willa. And I'm Maya. Thanks for watching WCCO 4 at the State Fair. This has been a WCCO 4 news update from the Minnesota State Fair. Thanks for watching.